you're digging your foundation, you're going to need a level. You get these off your plan. Whenever your site survey is done, when you're buying a site, if you give uh, the elevation of your site, this is elevation meters above sea level. I know at this point here, I'm 83.5 meters above sea level. The highest point of my site is 800 millimeters above that. And with planning, they're saying I can be 300 millimeters above that. So my finished floor height is going to be roughly about 1100 above this point in the road. So when digging the foundation, we're going to need to know this height because it's going to affect how deep or how shallow you have to dig your foundation. And remember, what comes out always has to go back in. So you don't want to over excavate. It'll cost yourself money unnecessarily. You can see here on the laser, roughly about this point here is 1630. My finished path height needs to be 800 millimeters below that. But it's actually above it, so I'm subtracting 800 millimeters off that, which will give me my finished path height. From your finished path height, your foundation, your concrete needs to be 450 millimeters below your surface level. So on my staff, I go from 1620. needs to be now we have that set at 820 my concrete needs to be 450 millimeters below that to the top but you have 225 mil of concrete so from where this hits the laser I need to be a total height of 675 millimeters below this to get to the top or to my the bottom of my foundation set that that's giving us 675 millimeters so that's perfect level for the base of our foundation we can now use our laser level while we're digging to do quick spot checks and set the laser at that height and as we're walking around as he digs I can just give it a quick dip every three meters just to make sure he's within the reason but he not be far out So we're finished with our laser here for a few minutes, always remember turn your receiver off, it'll save the battery and be very careful with the staff because if it gets a knock your height can move. You should always check off your original height several times when you're digging or using a laser any time to make sure that it hasn't got moved and if you feel it as if it has got moved always go to your original point where you set it because even if you've set it off an original point and went down you can still have a plus or minus in the laser so it could be given a, a, a level reading if you then reset it from say your third mark which was level it could be out two millimeters and you reset it again you're out two millimeters there's four millimeters already so always set your laser off your original mark and you should never go wrong as you can see here we only have about 450 millimeters from the bottom of our foundation to the, to the top ground level what that means is we're going to have to make this ground up about nine inches which is about perfect that's perfect at the minute for your path height by the time you stone up and soil up it'll leave it your foundation is 450 millimeters below the ground so it's not often you get this lucky it's worked out very nice it's less digging it's less everything for us at the minute so super happy days dodgy digger drivers at it again hope he knows this coming out of his wages anything like this as soon as you take it out of the ground have a storage spot somewhere for it throw it in it you'll, if you sit this in the ground if you can strive over you'll never see it you'll never find it it's money wasted
isn't he only at 640 anyway? Well, you'd be as well to take an eye inch or two off that. <laughs> 